This video is going to go over the distance formula. The distance between the points A and B, with A being x sub 1, y sub 1, and B being x sub 2, y sub 2, is the square root of the quantity x sub 2 minus x sub 1 squared, plus the quantity y sub 2 minus y sub 1 squared. Let's go ahead now and take a look at an actual example applying the distance formula. Here we are being asked to find the distance between the points C, which is negative 5, 1, and D, which is negative 2, negative 8. So we can see here is listed the distance formula. So the first thing we need to do is identify which point is x sub 1, y sub 1, and we'll just take our first point here. And the negative 5 being the x coordinate will be our x sub 1, and the 1 is the y coordinate, so that will be our y sub 1. And then we will go to our second point, D. Negative 2 is the x value, so we will have that be x sub 2. And negative 8 is the y value, so we will have that be y sub 2. And now we just go up to the distance formula and plug in the pieces that we know. So here we have the square root. And the first quantity is where we take x sub 2 minus x sub 1. So the first thing we do is identify what did we label as x sub 2, and that is negative 2. And from that, we subtract x sub 1, which in this case is negative 5. So we have that quantity squared. And to that, we are adding the difference of the y-coordinates. So y sub 2 is a negative 8. minus y sub 1 is just 1, and we have that quantity squared. Now it's just a matter of simplifying. So the first thing we're going to do is look at that first quantity, negative 2 minus a negative 5. And remember, minus a negative is really plus a positive. So this quantity here simplifies to a negative 2 plus 5. So we have that quantity squared. And we will continue uh, negative, and again, we are still taking the square root of all of this. Um, on the right side there, so we have plus a negative 8 minus 1 simplifies to a negative 9 squared. So that is the second step there. And continuing on, we will still continue to simplify that first quantity. We have a negative 2 plus 5, we are still taking the square root, so a negative 2 plus 5 is 3 squared, plus we still have the negative 9 squared, and continuing on now, we will just go ahead and square each portion, 3 squared is 3 times 3, which is 9, a negative 9 squared is a negative 9 times a negative 9, which is 81. And now we simply add the two together. 9 plus 81 is 90. So the distance here between C and D is the square root of 90.